Hello everyone, this is Richard G, and today I will be showing you how to defeat Blaine's Gym in the Gym Challenges of Pokemon Tower Defense 2. This one is going to take a little longer to set up, at least for the number of Pokemon. So we have Charizard, Pikachu, Squirtle, Bulbasaur, and Butterfree. So to start out, we will keep Blaze, and we will make sure we start with Scary Face right from the start. And then for Pikachu, we're going to start with Nuzzle, and keep the ability static. For Squirtle, we're going to go with Rain Dish and start with Rain Dance. And for Bulbasaur, we're going to start with Overgrow and start with Leech Seed. And then for Butterfree, Tidden Lens to power up Silver Wind, which will allow us to defeat this gym a bit easier. That Tinted Lens is very important. Make sure you have it. And then go with Tailwind to start out. All right, and Oak's going to give us some advice, but you're watching this video anyway. So we're going to start out by bringing stuff in real quick. So we're just going to get the right angle here. Charizard, Pikachu, then we're going to get Squirtle in there, and we're going to get Bulbasaur, and then we're going to get Butterfree in these tiles. Once that Tailwind's set, you can start Silver Winding. Okay. And then make sure both Charizard and Pikachu go for the fastest. Do this as quick as you can, because you don't have much time to do it. Okay, Charizard's getting targeted, as you see that by that little red arrow thing. Move it out of the way, that's Magmortar's attack. And then as soon as that rock is thrown, you can go back. You don't want anything to get hit up here, because they will die to the lava pools when that rock lands. If a rock lands on the bottom, it will not cause a lava pool. But it will still kill, so you don't want to get hit. We're basically killing this stuff, getting some training in, but at the same time, we are waiting for Butterfree to get its stats up, which we'll zoom in a bit to see. Once they're all up there, we said, up oh, someone got targeted, and that's Pikachu. Unfortunately, that's going to mean that we've lost a tile. We can still get by, but it's gonna be a little trickier. In fact, we're gonna quickly make a very, we're gonna make a very quick switch and let Nuzzle go first. All right. Let's, you have to watch out for the arrows from, from Magmortar's attack. It's on Squirtle. Get something out of the way. Wait for it. And once it's thrown, you can go back. All right. Alright, at this point, we can send over to here. Get that Rain Dance reset. And start attacking. The other four can deal with that. Leave Squirtle to deal with the Magmortar. And, oh, something's gonna get hit. Alright, Charizard's gotta get out of the way again. Oh, wait, that's going after Pikachu. Be careful who's getting hit. You don't want anything dying during this. Magmora's getting down, but keep watching. Okay, we got two targets on right now. We will let these go and move quickly, and we are safe. When that Magmora's low, it's going to start doing multiple rocks. And once Magmortar's down, and, and if, if there's anything else, kill those, and then you will have defeated Blaine. Alright, so that's that, Jim. For defeating this one, you will be getting a special Charmander holding a bunch of Charmander holding the Charizardite X. Alright, that is Blaine's Jim.